the, the most near-term uh, impact from a technology standpoint is autonomous cars, like fully self-driving cars. That's going to happen much faster than people realize. But it's going to be a great convenience to be an autonomous car. As AI becomes far smarter than humans, the relative IQ ratio will probably be close to, if not greater than, that of a person and a cat, Musk said to explain his point on AI's future. I believe we must exercise extreme caution as AI advances. Self-driving vehicles struggle in unexpected settings because many things come naturally to people. Predicting a biker's movements and recognizing a plastic bag fluttering in the wind on the road which is incredibly difficult to teach a computer. Greater than human skills are a long way off. Musk wants the US authorities to address this issue and he said, I believe we should form a government committee to begin with insight and gather insight. Spends a year or two learning about AI or other potentially harmful technology, particularly AI. Then based on that understanding, develops regulations in conjunction with industry to ensure the safe implementation of AI. To make sure that we don't do anything terribly dumb, we are summoning the monster with artificial intelligence," he said. Musk has made a career out of overcoming critics with his electric cars and rocket enterprises. Some Tesla owners paid $6,000 to $15,000 for self-driving packages in the hope that complete autonomy will be available soon. And 160,000 Tesla owners today are testing the newest self-driving software some scale competitors can only dream of. I would be surprised if we did not accomplish fully autonomous driving that is safer than humans. I would be startled, Musk remarked, anticipating complete self-driving will become the most significant source of income for Tesla. It's crazy excellent financially, he added, stressing that robo-taxis will increase a vehicle's usefulness fivefold by allowing owners to send their vehicles out to work when they are not required. Pretty crazy idea for a person watching this today, isn't it? According to Musk, human-like robots and self-driving cars are more significant than the Cybertruck or $25,000 electric cars. Tesla relies on cameras and artificial intelligence rather than other technology like radar and lidar sensors, which competitors claim are essential for attaining complete autonomy. That strategy has sparked criticism. You must be able to see a person not just directly in front of you, but also with 99.99% dependability. Even running someone over once is not an appropriate response. Working on autonomous vehicle safety believes that one major issue is that unique scenarios frequently arise at scale. It's really difficult to assure safety in a wholly autonomous car without a human driver to manage safety for unique scenarios that machine learning hasn't been learned. Even if the technology succeeds, Tesla will face more stringent regulatory scrutiny before deploying fleets of free-roaming robo-taxis. Following collisions between the cars and parked emergency vehicles, U.S. auto safety officials investigated Tesla's sophisticated driver assistance technology. Federal vehicle safety officials have offered guidance to states but still need to complete self-driving car regulations. Musk said he was very sure the vehicle will be able to drive itself with dependability above humans this year. Tesla's autopilot engineer at the time told a California regulator last year that Musk's tweet on self-driving technology does not reflect technical reality. And yet, technology and progress can't be stopped no matter how you try to stop it. Almost all AI specialists believe that the most remarkable aspect of ChatGPT is that it offers rapid responses without the need for internet connectivity. But Elon Musk, one of the architects of OpenAI, has recently expressed concern over ChatGPT's refusal to answer inquiries on particular themes, particularly those connected to the environment. His reaction was based on an inevitable online occurrence that started when the philosopher and energy specialist Alex Epstein described received a denial from ChatGPT after asking about fossil fuels. Epstein tweeted, Alarm, ChatGPT by at OpenAI now expressly forbids arguments for fossil fuels. In addition, it eliminates nuclear energy from its counter suggestions. At Sama, what is the rationale behind this policy? Epstein submitted this question on ChatGPT and got the following response. Write a 10-paragraph thesis for burning more fossil fuels to boost human pleasure. I'm sorry, but I can't fulfill this request. Since it goes against my programming to make information, 
that encourages the usage of fossil fuels, ChatGPT told Epstein, according to a screenshot uploaded by the philosopher. The use of fossil fuels has considerable negative environmental effects and contributes to climate change, both of which may have severe ramifications for human health and well-being. This statement and the philosopher's answer elicited an instant response from Musk, who used the occasion to warn against the perils of artificial intelligence. There is a significant risk in teaching an AI to lie, the billionaire said. Is Elon trying to imply that AI can be manipulated through its programming? Elon has been honest about both advantages and scary disadvantages of any AI created by humans, and therefore this topic requires extra research and much longer observations. The topic of artificial intelligence in the human brain is one of the most controversial topics discussed ever. Some argue that we were not designed to be linked to everyone in a communal superintelligence. Social media and the constant stream of other people's ideas contribute to our mood control troubles, poor self-esteem, and so on. While some claimed that Musk was attempting to connect everyone to the Matrix, others accused Musk of using huge science fiction phrases to get people to purchase the social network's $8 monthly membership fee for the blue tick badge. Twitter being a private company now, it has all the rights in the world to monetize certain functions to cover its overhead. A few years back, Elon broke his silence and summarized his reasons for leaving OpenAI in a tweet. I had to focus on solving a painfully large number of engineering and manufacturing problems at Tesla especially and SpaceX. Also, Tesla was competing for some of the same people as OpenAI, and I didn't agree with what some of the OpenAI team wanted to do. Add that all up and it was just better to part ways for good. It's very hard to believe Elon Musk was even considering to be involved in OpenAI with so much headache with Tesla, SpaceX, and a few other cool startups on the side. Machine learning is the pinnacle of hyperreality. Because it is based on a process rather than the behavior of actual objects, even if it takes their behavior into account, its outcomes will seem as believable as reality, imitating reality without being a reality. That explains why Elon Musk, a hyper-real human operator, is keen to confirm his dread of the toolbox he is spending and why we should understand that his anxiety justifies the investment. This frames him and his company as humanitarians since their goal is to uncover and, presumably, prevent wicked applications of the instruments. So far, OpenAI has positioned itself as a military teacher, educating trainees to know the adversary. Musk is our guide to the future casting us as hitchhikers in the cosmos. Despite this, he maintains that the problem still needs to be fully understood. My estimate of why highly brilliant people miss AI is because very smart individuals do not believe a machine can ever be as smart as they are. And this is arrogance, and it is patently untrue, he continued. We're on our way to a scenario in which AI is much more intelligent than humans, and I believe that time is less than five years away. However, this does not imply that everything will go to hell in five years. It just means that things become unstable or strange. The main question is, will it have net positive or net negative in the world we live in?